Hello, I'm Kobe Kornfeld. Hello, my name is Isaac Bendayan. Hi, my name is Daniel Hodes. Hi, my name is Nadav Greiber. Hi, my name is Yael Schwartz. I'm Harris Gagnon. Hi, my name is Ruben Artsy. Hi, my name is Avi Shapiro. Alexandra Friedlander. Noah Ackenstein. My mom, my younger brother, my mom, my best friend, my mom, my father, my mom, my father, my mother, my mother. She's always taking good care of me, taught me a lot of values, my morals, who I am today. Yeah, I, I tell her everything. She's my rock. Caring and kind, and always will talk to me if I need someone to talk to. I'd say we have a really, really strong relationship. Uh, sometimes I'd say it's too strong because we can be like too real with each other, so we get in a lot of arguments, but it's like, we love each other so much so we get over it really quickly. He was born with autism, and so I've always felt an yeah, immediate connection with him, and I felt like since I'm the older brother, I feel immediately responsible for him. It's funny. It's good. Quality content you can hear here. Oh my god. <laughs> I just sent me a picture of my dog. And this one, and I wrote a new um, Hamoud. It seems cute. Well, it's only 11 p.m. here. Is it 9 a.m. there? 8 a.m. Aha. I need to Mahood. Still alive. And I got a picture of it giving him a thumbs up. Just me telling her the name of a hotel that we were looking at at the Dead Sea. <laughs> She said, are you even going to come home? And I said, I don't want to. And that was our last conversation. Maybe on her birthday in like a card, but I can't remember the last time I was like, Mama, thank you for everything that you do. I've told my mom a lot that I, that I love him a lot. I think that now since I'm away from him, I'm starting to realize more how much he means to me. probably too long ago. She was like, I tell you I miss you every day and you never say it back. I was like, oh my gosh, like I guess I didn't even realize it. Like the last time I told him was a long time ago. But uh you know, uh yeah. Long time ago. I hope to be as good a mother as you are someday. It's kind of, you know, I want to, that's what I want to be like. I want to be like her as a mother. Everything that she does is to make sure I'm happy. So it would be to just acknowledge that I see that and that I really appreciate that and that I hope that I continue to bring her joy and bring her happiness and make her proud. If I can get through that, I'd love to just tell him that I'm going to be back soon and um, I'll be back for a long time. Tell her how happy I am, like that she was able to get me on this trip, and I'm having a great time, and that I want to see her again when I get back. That I'm doing really well here, and that I'm glad I came, but also makes me want, it makes me like more grateful to come home. Kind of just how grateful I am to have her in my life. Obviously, I'm growing up, and it makes sense, and it's it's okay. We're moving on, but you know, just the little things like this sometimes. I guess so. She's gonna think something's wrong. I feel like she's gonna be a little bit worried about me. <laughs>